Hello everyone, this is GWiz, and today I'm going to be connecting a Blue Yeti microphone to an iPhone 12 Pro. Hello everyone, this is GWiz. Today we're going to be reviewing the Blue Yeti. As I speak, I'm using the Blue Yeti right now, and this is what the Blue Yeti looks like when you get the box. This cost me about $100 at Best Buy. With tax, it was about $118. I'm using no microphone right now, and I'm just using my iPhone's microphone, so you can hear the difference. Back to the Blue Yeti microphone. As you can hear, the Blue Yeti microphone is a lot louder. I'm using my normal toned voice, and the sound quality is much higher. I'm just going to show you the cable that plugs into the Blue Yeti. The USB connects to the phone and the small um, port there connects to the Blue Yeti. And so now I'm at home. You can hear there's no background noise anymore. The Blue Yeti picks up on sound a lot better than just a cell phone microphone. The cell phone microphone just doesn't compare to a studio level microphone. This is the manual that the microphone came with. Um, you won't really need it too much since the microphone automatically pairs with the cell phone. Um, there's no software that you need, so don't worry about that. I'm just gonna unfold the microphone so that you can see the bottom and also tighten it down. I just sped up the video so I could tighten down the microphone. To get the microphone to work for my iPhone, I had to plug in the USB adapter and the headphone set. Once I did this, it paired to my phone no problem. You may also need this adapter, um, specifically the one that allows power to go into it. Links in the description below if you want to find this adapter. If you think you'd like the Blue Yeti for your phone or for your desktop, it's priced anywhere between $93 and $128 on Amazon. Give this video a like and subscribe if you thought it was helpful and take care.